Hello, my name is Mike Grossenbach. I'm the product specialist for distributed products for Mitsuto America. And in this video, I'll be demonstrating some of the basic features and functions of the new K200 counter for linear scales, such as zeroing, presetting, increasing the resolution, and setting the K200 counter into lathe mode. The K200 will default to millimeters, but can easily be changed to inches by pressing and holding the unit button until the millimeter LED disappears, which is about three seconds. To zero an axis, just press the corresponding axis button that has a circle around it. To preset an axis, press the corresponding axis button without the circle, and then press enter. The previous preset value will be loaded. Or press the axis button and type in another value and press enter. The K200 can be set to either absolute or incremental mode, and there are 10 coordinate tool presets for each. To switch from ABS to incremental mode, just press the ABS incremental button. The sub-display will show which mode and coordinate you're in. To switch to a new coordinate preset, press the coordinate button and then a number. For example, this would get you into your second coordinate system in incremental mode. If you needed to calculate distances on the fly, there's also a calculator function which is accessed by pressing CAL. For example, if you wanted to calculate a distance based off of a 45 degree angle, you could just press 45, then sign, and then the multiply button, and the length. Press enter and it calculates the value for you. To exit back into the measurement mode, just press CAL again. After powering on the unit with the switch and back, if you have a flashing display, just hit the C button to clear it. You can change this in the parameter setup by changing the startup setting from new to auto. This is explained in the next section.